So you want to get better at prompting Convex Chef? Well, you're in luck as I'm going to show you five ways you can really up your prompting game. Just like people, AIs really do perform better if you break the problem down into smaller, simpler chunks. Start small, get something simple working to begin with, and then build up bit by bit to get your fully working idea. Chef is designed to be a blank slate that you can mold into whatever you like. And as such, the UI that it outputs at the moment is fairly generic. If you wanna get something looking a little bit better, then try offering suggestions for colors, fonts, and other design related things. And if you do this, you should see significantly better results. Try using other AI tools such as ChatGPT or Claude to generate prompts for you. For example, try this. Create a short prompt for an AI app builder that does X. We found that this results in some really great looking apps. In the future, Chef will be able to assist with this prompt writing step itself. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you don't want to miss when that feature drops. I'm not sure if you're aware, but AI isn't perfect. Fortunately, Chef does have a built-in rewind ability that lets you return to a previous step should it start to make a mistake. So don't hesitate to use this feature if you think you're cooking up a stinker and you want to return to an earlier version. This one's similar to the first tip, but you should try and keep your prompts short and sweet. We found 300 words or less to be about ideal. What you want to do is give the AI just enough detail to implement the feature, but not too much to overwhelm it and have it lose focus on what you're trying to implement. Alrighty then, I hope you found those tips useful. If you have other tips yourself or questions, please do drop a comment down below or come find me on our Discord server. Until next time, thanks for watching. Cheerio.